modern dance has taken on a new meaning for Clement Mensa. His newest student, Adele, shows up to dance class each week via Skype, mirroring Clement's moves from the comfort of his living room in Baghdad, Iraq. Adele is a law student by day, but it's dance that moves him. He often takes to the streets of Baghdad to practice and produce films of his latest steps. But in that city, dancing can be dangerous. We discovered a dancer in Baghdad um, where dancing, it, it, you can't dance in the public space. If you dance in the public space, you're liable to be arrested or attacked. Jonathan Hollander runs New York's Battery Dance Company and has organized workshops for young people across the world for years including one in Iraq in 2012. He was distressed to hear that the growing threat from Islamic State militants is putting the Iraqi people on edge and breaking up creative communities across that country. So he posted an online ad of sorts, offering an artistic outlet for any Iraqi in need. Adele, a Kurd from the north now living in Baghdad, jumped at the chance. We're trying to create a virtual community or a feeling of community in a situation where there is no community. There's no one else for him to interact with. To, there's no sounding board. So we are providing, for the time being, a sounding board. And that's what is incredibly valuable. Clement and Adele meet in their virtual studio weekly to practice and to chat. Clement says the choreography is key, but that these lessons are about making meaningful connections. There's much more that we share beyond just the dance movement. And uh, there's uh, this artistry, there is this um, joy. Right now we are interacting, we are bonding. And I think on a human level that is something that is very, very important. Adele seems to agree. I love, I love, the, I love that when, when they teach me uh, in Skype. He says the reward of exploring his passion is worth the risk. Clement says he one day hopes to dance with Adele in person here on the streets of New York City. But for now, Skype will be the tool that Battery Dance uses to empower young performers around the world and to be the audience they've never had. Patrice Howard, Rudolph, New York.